So today, I, one of the reasons I'm in Florida today, obviously to get away from the cold weather, but I'm, I'm getting married today. Oh, wonderful. Oh my God, that's great news. That's wonderful news. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. What, what is her name again then? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so it's Holly. Yeah. Holly, yeah. James interviewed me for a job and the elevator doors opened at the interview and there was James just standing right there and it like surprised me a little bit. So she got hired and then uh, <laughs> we worked together for more than a year. I knew I liked Holly as a person. I thought she was great and I, you know, I thought she was always very personable and very easy to get along with and talk to and so I liked that about her in general and so that was sort of like the work relationship. Right, but everything changed at one fateful happy hour <laughs> last July. And James was like, well, I'm gonna leave. And I was like, you know, don't leave. You know, it was like a very dramatic moment. And he didn't leave. And we hung out for the rest of the night and it was so amazing. And we kind of hung out together Constantly. almost every day after then until today. <laughs> it's true. This wedding is a secret. So we're going to come back and be like, surprise! The word that really, for me, sums up our relationship is fun. We have such a good time together. And I'm just so excited that I found someone that I can have fun with forever. I didn't think it was cheesy when people said, oh, I'm going to marry my best friend, whatever. And I, I think I wanted that always, but I never really knew if it was truly possible. But this is so... It's possible. James is my best friend. I don't want to spend as much time with anybody else. <laughs> We're going to be a mess tomorrow. Uh, yeah, no, I'm going to cry so much tomorrow. There's going to be a lot of editing that's going to have to happen to cut out <laughs> all my tears. I love you. that I wanted to marry James really early on. And there's one instance that I can't even remember what we were doing, but I just looked at him and I thought, oh, this is so it. He has all the qualities that I've ever wanted in a partner. He's so understanding and loving. I just, I, I knew early on. I can't, I can't think of a specific time, but I just always kind of knew. And I just think that we make a better unit together than we do individually. And I think she's so smart and talented and creative. And, uh, I try to tell her all this stuff as often as I can. I think that the last, you know, about year and a half has been like the best moment of my life because I've been with Holly and I just look forward to continuing that. Okay, James and Holly, you ready? Yeah. Ready. Okay. Holly, I've been waiting to meet you all my life. Before I met you, I sometimes wondered if I was even capable of loving someone enough to want to be married. Now I know it was because I hadn't met you yet. Hey. The first time we were here in Key West, when we snuck onto a beach to light wish lanterns into the water, I wish that I could spend every day of the rest of my life having fun with you. I made that wish because there are times I can't fall asleep, because I'd rather stay up and talk to you about everything all night. You're smart, you make me laugh so hard I can hardly catch my breath, and you show me appreciation in so many ways every single day. 
Ali, you are my best friend, and today I vow to always be your greatest ally as well as your biggest fan. I vow to always make you laugh and for us to always be a fun couple, even when we're old with kids who think we're dorks. <laughs> you are my best friend. You're my true love. And I'm so glad to start the next leg of this adventure as husband and wife. Today is truly the happiest day of my life and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. I vow today to be the best husband, friend, partner, and father I can be. I love you. By the power vested in me, I joyfully proclaim that you are husband and wife. So